Friday is the last day. By Friday, we need to have decided what you're going to do for your junior cycle project. You need to be able to look through your folders. You need to see what's good in there, what needs improvement, how you can improve on it if you need to improve. Technology has changed how I work in the classroom immensely. Each individual student has a library in their school bag that they can take out at any point and explore any museum in the world or you know any image in the world that they, they, they want to look at or read about or find out about. They have that library there. They also have a great camera available to them at all times that they can use. It's an even playing field. They're all working from the same tool. Everybody's camera is the same and does the same thing, giving me a way to get to know the students a little bit more. Things like Google Forms are brilliant, you know, to just figure out a little bit, look a little bit deeper at how an individual student is doing. I learned things during the pandemic. I mean, it was so interesting for me as a teacher because I learned new ways to teach that I'm still taking into the classroom, recording demos you know, even close-ups of little spe specific demos that I might do. Now I use it in the art classroom as well. Another thing that I found helpful was using the Apple pencils. You know, students would send me work instead of the traditional way of showing them my demo. I was able to draw over the photographs of their work. Didn't destroy their work. They could see very, very clearly what might make the, the work better. I love how the students have the freedom to express themselves, to be themselves. They get to explore absolutely anything. The, the possibilities are endless.